we look at these numbers, while there is an advantage in height and reach for Soto Caras, he's really not going to use them. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the tough longtime contender, Jesus Soto Caras. Introducing Marcos El Chino Maidana. I want you to keep this fight clean at all times, protect yourself at all times. And what I say, you must obey. Good luck to both of you. Venezuela, touch him up. Touch him up. Between Marcos Maidana and Jesus Soto Caras. Referee Kenny Bayless, the bell in round one. For Maidana, the 202. And now Maidana going Soto Caras. Flashes the jab. Straight right hand by Soto Caras. Counter jab from Maidana. So again. Man, but here at welterweight, He's not so big as Jesus Soto Caras has fought some of his fights even at junior middleweight, and he's the bigger man in there tonight. Caras has fought at 147, even 154. Nice overhand right by Caras. And there's the triple jab from Maidana. Wins, and so far, involved in another exciting fight here to kick things off. The opening round. Six first round knockouts. That came in the first eight fights of his professional career. And let me say that we've seen three jabs from Maidana already. He's with new trainers. We've seen two fighters' head points taken away at the same point. Here comes Kata. by Maidana. And another lead left hook that glances off the glove as Soto Caras caught that one and then gets popped with a jab. In the replay you saw Soto Caras sport what can best be described as an incredulous smile when he had the point deducted. Gets caught on the jaw with that left hand and again Maidana get it on especially in Argentina. But right now it's Maidana and Soto Caras again fighting in that proverbial phone booth. And it's Maidana teeing off on Soto in the final minute of the second round but Soto Caras now hurt. Soto Caras has got some chin. Oh, and he, he's landing some <laughs> shots. With this kind of power, it could wear him down. And referee Kenny Bayless calling for the break. And again, referee Kenny Bayless has seen enough. Stop it or somebody gets disqualified. And he has warned them now. And he is taking a point away from Marcos Maidana. And a point being deducted to this welterweight bout is in the books. He's worked the body, he hasn't done that yet. I said straighten out the right hand, but you know what? He hasn't had to because he's landed overhand right. Combinations now by Maidana, Maidana, as he throws a lead right, but then he's gonna come with the hook. Now that was a wide left hook, but bell. he's like, you know, enough of this. <laughs> yeah, referee Kenny Bayless warning both corners about that extracurricular activity. A very electric atmosphere. And a test comes back with a right, but it's Maidana getting the better of the exchange to kick off this third round. I'll tell you, I don't see him this round. Let's see how the round ends up ending up. But right now, Maidana trying to box, but Jesus Soto Caras uh, getting off more punches. Yes, yeah, Soto Caras. Maidana landing 38. So these men are active and they are fairly accurate. Soto Caras with a three inch reach advantage. Maidana shots as well. And you know, he negates his height and reach out by leaning in like this every fight. Look at Maidana rolling though. Look at that. Yeah. Final minute of the fourth round, Soto Caras trying to find Maidana, bobbing and weaving at Maidana. About 30 seconds ago, I saw Maidana roll back and counter with the right hand. I mean, he's doing things that slick boxers do. You can see Robert Garcia's teachings in there. Yeah, by far. Coming in, landing the right hand. Another right cross to the jaw. Lead left hook by Maidana and Soto Caras goes to the bottom. Soto Caras working the body. Maidana along the ropes, pivots away. An electric atmosphere here at the end. He is taking a lot of punishment from Marcos Maidana. Straight left from Soto Caras. Packs the body. He's fought as a lefty here for a while Maidana now. comes back with a one-two of his own. Terrific action here in Las Vegas. Mexican Independence Day weekend. Straight oh, versatile tonight. But I'll tell you one thing. These guys are in great shape because they have not stopped the fast pace from the opening belt. for him, or at least hasn't been so far. Then he squares up, which is bad. Maidana able again to circle away and come back with a combination of his own. Terrific action here. Wow. And again, they exchange blows. 
What a fight and what a... It's being billed as knockout kings and if this action keeps up, you never know who is going to be the first they don't even look tired. No, Soto Kraus threw 102 punches in the last round. Jab has really been the key to success. Oh, and there's a vicious left hand that popped the head back. My daughter, he felt it wasn't a real knockdown. Felt he was hit behind the head. But uh, so far, taking the... See this crowd. I mean, they're, they're fired up for this match. Oh, huge left hook by Cross. A very appreciative crowd. Nailing Soto Karas, who absorbed the punch coming forward. And there's a lead left hook that catches Soto Karas, but he walks right through it. Maidana getting busy. A fan favorite through and through. We saw a terrific fighter from Argentina last week on Showtime. Lucas Matisse. 26 wins by way of knockout. And of course, Maidana with an incredible knockout ratio. 28. Swarming Maidana. Maidana keeping him at bay with a jab, but gets caught with a one-two combination. Leading Maidana, who comes back with a piston-like jab. There. <laughs> the break by Kenny Bayless, and now Soto Kana's working the body. Maidana flicking that jab, and a great testimonial for the training expertise of Against Robert that Robert. ropes, we'll see. I'll tell you, he may, have been, he may have gotten hurt with a body shot, or he may have just wanted to smother Soto Kana's work. And Either Soto way, Kana's as Maidana now lands a right hand. Eric Gomez, the matchmaker for Golden Boy, swore that this would be the, could, this could be the best fight of the night. An unbelievable atmosphere here in Las Vegas, the fight capital. Making a change in his professional career, hooking up with Robert Garcia in Oxnard, California. And there's a lead left hook down. Soto Caras beginning to Take over in this round, final minute, walking down. The matchmaker, he should know, huh? Two more fights still to come, including the main event. Call of the world. It's being billed as knockout kings. We've had one knockout in our first fight. This has been looking for a signature win in his career. Could this be the night? 29-year-old, 11-year veteran. All right, this last minute's gonna decide the round for me, guys. I thought Maidana controlled the, same the first thing, yes. Could be frustration and fatigue on the part of Maidana, too. Yeah, I agree, Al. Soto Karas again taking the... Still a long way to go in this match. Up until this point, Soto Karas sighted wins over David Estrada in his first fight with... It's not the first time that Soto Karas has been cut, breaking them apart. Each have had one point deducted, and they almost came to blows at the bell. Maidana, we talked about him using the jab. When he does so, a double jab, and look what it does. It sets up the right hand, a straighter right hand. Soto Karas came out, joined at Maidana. Cicito Lopez. Unofficial Showtime scoring. A very close fight, as you can see, indicated by our unofficial scores. A majority draw right now, and another point deduction. Kenny Bayless taking the point away from Maidana. So the crowd has roared back in the second minute, and it seems like this third minute he's winning it as well. Soto Karas pounding away on Maidana. Suffered cuts in both fights with Mike Jones, as well in, as in fights against Chris Smith. Taking the fight to Maidana. Maidana with the lead left hook. He's looking pretty sharp here tonight, but Maidana comes back with a left hook. And another lead left hook, and Soto There's a point to be made here. Soto Karas is walking through a lot of Maidana's offense, and I don't think Maidana is used to this. You know, no. at 140 pounds, he hit guys like this. Maidana looks to come back in the final few seconds of what has been a terrific tilt here tonight. And Maidana Rosado, midway through the round and the fight, a fantastic War, Soto Karas cut over the right eye early in round six. By the end of the round, it started to close, but a great yes. round. And they were either knocked out or running for their, on their bikes. That is you know, such a good point. Mentally, this might be a little bit debilitating for Maidana that his power. While he's busy. Oh!
shoot to Soto. Valiantly trying to fight back, gets hurt with the left hook. Soto caught us. Stumbling, oh, and eats another straight right hand. Round eight underway of this oh. WBA title eliminator, and Mike Donna firing off the right hand, but Soto reinvigorated. And there's a straight right double hand. And another right hand that finds the head of Soto Caras, now beginning to take all kinds of punishment. Kenny Bayless steps in. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time of 43 seconds in round number eight. Our referee in charge, Kenny Bayless, stops the contest. He is the winner by way of technical knockout. He is now the WBA Intercontinental Welterweight Champion, Marcos El Chino.